Today, we are getting into the new Pokemon 151 Binder Collection Box. So, let's start opening it up and see what's inside. So, inside, you do get this really cool looking binder. Um, it's got, you know, of course, you got Pokemon Company branding up here, TCG up top. And then you do have this really cool art style. You also have this enlarged Pokeball. You've got Mew here. You do have this a little elastic band, which personally, I have never really enjoyed binders that have this style. However, I'm willing to give the Pokemon 151 a binder simply because it's for base set. Uh, personally, I'm more of a Vault-X type guy when it comes to binders. I like it to have a zipper and I like the, the protection that Vault-X offers. Um, whereas this one, I mean, it, it's, it seems like it's, it's decent. Uh, you know, here's the spine of it. Um, oh, look at that. It even says Scarlet 151 if Card Kim will pick it up. So there we go. Wow. Uh, so I'm sure it will protect the cards, but let's take a look inside and see what they've given us here to work with. So this is a nine pocket binder. The pages look very similar to Vault-X. Are they side loading? Oh my goodness. They, oh, they are. Ooh, ooh, okay. All right. I'm a fan. I love side loading binders uh, in case you can't tell. It looks like it's going to hold up. I actually might use this for the 151 set. Not going to lie. There you go. Scarlet and Violet 151. There is the binder. We're going to just get that out of the way. Not only does the binder come in this box, um, which I picked up from my local card store for about, I think $25. But of course it also comes with, check this out, four packs of 151. And it wouldn't be a true opening if we didn't actually open something. So without further delay, we're going to crack open into these packs and see what is what. Are we going to pull anything crazy out of 151 today? I'm really excited. We do have sleeves at the ready in the event that we do. I know it's only four packs, but with 151, I am hoping beyond all hope. Uh, that the poll rates are a little bit better than our video earlier this week, which if you haven't seen that, uh, I picked up the new Evolving Powers box from Target as we issue out code card number one. And I will be sure to link that video up in the cards and of course down in the description for this video as well. So you guys can enjoy that experience to say the least. Alrighty, here we go. We have a grass leaf type energy to get things off to the races. We got a Clefairy, Machop, Man, it is great to be back to 151. Let me tell you, Porygon, Electabuzz. I think that's the first time we've seen Electabuzz in this set. Dragonair, Seedra, let's go. We got Kabuto. We got Ninoqueen, that's a first. There we go for the Reverse Hollow, number one. We've got Cubone for number two and into. We got Ditto for the Hollow. That's so cool. I mean, I know it's not like an epic banger or anything, but it's a Hollow Ditto. This is the first time I've pulled Ditto. So cool, especially since I think I'm gonna master set it. I know, cause I, I never got to do it as a kid uh, for the original base set. I do have a, a handful of cards, which I might showcase here on the channel in the, in the coming days and weeks, but I never got to actually master set the original base set. This is the code. Well, I had it. We had it right side up and then we changed it. I don't know why. We got another code card to enjoy for y'all on the home front. We have ourselves another energy. It is in fact a hollow energy. You know, even, even if you don't count them, I do sleeve them. Uh, just because it's hollow, it's shiny. I don't want to damage it. I don't want to scratch it up. So I'll at least sleeve it and put it in the back. If you don't want to count it as a hit, a-okay, that's fine. We won't get too over the top excited about it because it, after all, it is just an energy. But I digress and we continue. We have Lickitung, we have Venonat, we got a Pidgey, we got Poliwag, just chilling in his little pond. Doug Trio, we got Hauntar, all right. Hitmonlee, that looks so cool. We've got Porygon for one. You got Giovanni's Charisma for two and into an Omastar for the Hollow. Very cool. I haven't seen that one. That's a first as well. I'm loving the fact that even though this is only a four pack offering in this product, we haven't really doubled up on anything that we already pulled. Um, I mean, I know in a previous opening, we did get a different version of Giovanni's Charisma. So I'll be sure to link that video, of course, from our initial 151 opening uh, on release day. If you haven't seen that up in the cards and down in the description as well. Um, but it's nice to get other versions of cards as well as we get things off to the races with another code card. There you guys go. Three out of four. We are moving and grooving. It's a fighting type energy. We got ourselves a Magnemite, Caterpie, 
Evie looking adorable as always. Grimer, Magneton to go with that Magnemite we just pulled. Nitto Queen again. I'm not complaining. That's totally fine. We got ourselves a Victory Bell. Nice. Protective goggles for all the fire we're about to pull. We've got Antique Helix Fossil and into Beedrill for the Hollow. We do have Beedrill already, but it's very cool to get some Beedrill love. Some people did not appreciate Beedrill back in the day. Some people still don't appreciate Beedrill now, which is A-OK. -okay. Everybody has their own favorites that they gravitate towards, but it's cool to just see that Beedrill gets a bit of love in this set by getting turned into a Hollow. So very cool indeed. All right, dear friends, this is the last and final pack of today's opening. You already know what I'm going to say, but I'll say it anyways. Head on down if you haven't done so already. Smash that like button as we issue out the final code card for today's opening as it helps the channel grow and the community grow tremendously. We will love all the support that you guys lend our way as we get into another hollow leaf type energy. We've got a Magnemite, Caterpie. Are we getting into some last pack magic? Let's find out. We got Eevee. An antique dome fossil, which makes sense to go with the other one we pulled from the last pack. Leftovers, Persian, okay. Muck, let's see, what are we getting into today? A Moltres, okay, very cool. I have not seen Moltres yet this set, so that's a first, that's awesome. Right, Vaporeon, and last but certainly not least, into Dodrio for the Hollow. Very nice indeed. That's gonna do it for today's opening. Be sure and leave a like on this video on your own. And if you haven't done so already, consider subscribing to the channel so that you too can become part of the Kyber crew. Also, don't forget to hit that little bell notification button so that you don't miss any awesome content that is coming your way in the very near future. Down in the comment section below, let us know, are you planning on picking up your own copy of the new Pokemon 151 binder collection box? Or are you planning on investing in some other 151 products? And as always, stay safe. I love you, have yourself an awesome rest of the day, and I will see you in the next one.